Ma'am. Ma'am, can you hear me? Slide your feet out to me. Ma'am. Caught on camera, a dramatic video shows an officer saving a woman from a fiery crash in Greenfield. That officer was able to pull her out just before parts of the car engine exploded. The crash happened last week, but we're just getting a glimpse of that officer's body camera footage tonight. CBS 4's Mike Sullivan brings us that firsthand look. Can you hear me? Police department. My husband woke up with a loud bang. Can you hear me, ma'am? Boom. Are you by yourself? Gail Locker could barely believe her eyes. There's the first one that was out the picture window. A car inflames the edge of her porch. You can go out there and see she come right off of 40 and she hit that culvert out there. Inside the car, 36-year-old Heather Fisher. She was kind of trapped in the car. The car was upside down. It was on fire. This after she had slammed into the back of another car. The other vehicle had either stopped or slowed in a one-lane construction zone on US 40. Police believe the driver of that vehicle, Arturo Casimiro, was driving drunk. Definitely not an area that you want to stop. When the crash happened, Greenfield Patrolman Blake Cruel was off duty and heading home around 1.30 in the morning. He saw her headlights coming and then they disappeared. So it was literally within seconds. Immediately, he went into action. Ma'am, can you hear me? Slide your feet out to me. I had to figure out a way, you know, to get her out of the car. Hey, ma'am, I'm pulling you out. Officer Cruel shimmied her through a smashed window. Moments later, smaller parts of the engine began to explode. Most time people see in a movie that a car explodes. They don't happen that way in real life. Ma'am. Nor do rescues as lucky as this. I said, don't tell me somebody died. And he said, no. A lot of fractures from the chest down, both legs, pelvis, back. Had Officer Cruel not been there, right place, right time. We may be doing a completely different story today. Hey, just hold my hand, okay? In Greenfield, I'm Mike Sullivan, CBS 4 News. Wow, remarkable. Now, Heather Fisher was taken to IU Methodist and is recovering from serious injuries. As for the other driver, he faces multiple felonies.